What's up, you guys? So today we're going to be talking about Bridgerton, okay? It's a great um, kind of new show, I guess. Came out like last December because um, now it's 2021. <laughs> Still have to work my mind around that. Um, but yeah, we're going to be talking about Bridgerton, uh, more specifically Chris Bowers. He is the musical composer for that show. I'm just really impressed by the overall soundtrack. I really, really love it. And I wanted to kind of spend some time today going over how it inspired me to work on a piece that's kind of like using the same um, essential components that Chris Bowers uses in his soundtrack, um, which is kind of like the cycle based uh, soundtrack, um, a lot of tension building, a lot of, um, you know, uh, uh, tension building and then release. And so um, I'm going to show you guys what I did and I hope you guys really enjoy it. Um, and then at the end, I'll show you guys just my overall piece. So I first began with figuring out what is the chord progression I'm going to use. I know that based on the show, again, like I said before, it's a lot of tension and then release. So initially I had a progression um, that kind of started off with a C minor chord, right? Um, you could do the C6 up top or you could do um, just a regular C minor. Um, depending on the uh, sequence or cycle that I was in, I added in that sixth chord, um, that sixth, uh, sorry. Um, so C minor to uh, B flat, okay, and there goes that six again. Um, now we have the A minor seven flat five um, to the F minor seven to the G seven. So after figuring out what the chord progression was going to be, now it's time for me to go ahead and actually create um, the patterns and orchestration around that chord progression. And so I first started off with the strings because the majority of the piece is going to be uh, held and carried by the strings um, through ostinato patterns. Um, and here and there you have some pads. But I wanted to first show you guys uh, what I'm doing with the ostinato pattern. I have loaded up right now chamber strings from uh, Spitfire Audio, um, a great, great, great um, string library. At this point, the uh, cycle is expanding, it's growing. Um, you hear more of the components, the different pieces coming together. Okay, so there you have it. Um, I'm gonna go ahead now and just shut up and just press play so you guys can hear um, the piece that I came with. I hope you guys enjoy it. Make sure you like, comment, tag people, share it on your socials. It goes a long way. Peace out. 